The Giant Jumperee. Rabbit was hopping home one day when he heard a loud voice coming from inside his burrow. I'm the Giant Jumperee and I'm scary as can be. Help! Help! cried Rabbit. What's the matter, Rabbit? asked Cat. There's a giant jumpery in my burrow, said Rabbit. Don't worry, said Cat. I'll slink inside and pounce on him. So Cat slunk up to the burrow. But just as she was about to slink inside, she heard a loud voice. I'm the giant jumpery and I'll squash you like a flea. meowed Cat. What's the matter, Cat? asked Bear. There's a giant jumpery in Rabbit's barrow, said Cat. Don't worry, said Bear. I'll put my big fairy paw inside and knock him down. So Bear swaggered up to the barrow. But just as he put his big furry paw inside, he heard a loud voice. I'm the giant jumpery and I'll sting you like a bee. Help! Help! bellowed Bear. What's the matter, Bear? asked Elephant. There's a giant jumpery in Rabbit's burrow, said Bear. Don't worry, said Elephant. I'll wrap my trunk round him and toss him away. So Elephant stomped up to the burrow. But just as he put his long grey trunk inside, he heard a loud voice. I'm the giant jumpery and I'm taller than a tree. Help! Help! trumpeted Elephant. What's the matter, Elephant? asked Mummy Frog. There, there's a giant jumpery in Rabbit's burrow, said Elephant. Don't worry, said Mummy Frog. I'll tell him to come out. No, no, don't do that, said all the other animals. He's as scary as can be, said Rabbit. He can squash you like a flea, said Cat. He can sting you like a bee, said Bear. And he's taller than a tree, said Elephant. But Mummy Frog took no notice of them. She jumped up to the burrow. I'm the giant jumpery and you're terrified of me, came the loud voice. The other animals backed away, but Mammy Frog wasn't scared. Come out, giant jumpery, she said. You're the one we want to see, so I'm counting up to three. One... Two, three. Then out jumped Baby Frog. Hello, ma'am. I'm the giant jumpery. And you're coming home to tea, said Mummy Frog. <laughs>